Hi, you welcome to Sass TV. My name is Belen Bez, and uh, this is what's going on for you. God bless ya. And I cannot wait to see the new you. This is what's going on. If you're watching this, please join me later today. And we're going to be doing, uh, it's either going to be some type of kickboxing or Tabata, something like that. Okay. So here we go. From the top of the reading, I do see here that when it comes down to property matters, there's something going on with property matters that it's being left in your hands. I do see you putting that on hold. I do see something coming here um, different. Whatever you were, you had, you're walking into something different with that, okay? This is going to come in within the next three to six days or three to six weeks now. When um, I do see uh, this message coming in about income. I will tell you leave love alone right now because it's not working out for you. It's going to cause endings and it's going to cause separations and it is going to cause loss. Move on. For the second week in April, do not entertain love. Let it go. Just go, 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 go. It's not going to work out. It's not. It's just like a big old steel post that you're trying to get around just go ahead and just walk around it and keep it pushing to somebody else now something's going on with anger and changes in decisions i do feel like with work you're going to be going to work a little bit more at this time but you're going to need to save your money uh, because if you don't save your money then you're going to see yourself overspending or giving it out to others I do see you having a good time, but then overthinking things. So what's going to be coming up probably in the next six weeks or so you're going to start to see stuff real clear you're going to struggle with coming from some type of, it could be family, it could be love, it could be children. You're going to be struggling with getting around a situation that you think that's going to work out. You can rewind the video and see what's going to be working out with that. The good thing that's going on is whatever's going on with that, you don't want to be bothered with having to walk away from it. And you're going to struggle with your revel, your mood swing. It's going to come out in a form of you being upset. Um, you're going to be a little upset. A little cranky, a little moody. But guess what? Right after that, work's going to tell you something about some changes in schedule. Some of you guys are going to be working from three to something or from six to something. That's coming in very, very, very fast towards the end of the time frame. And you're going to be seeing money. You're going to be seeing money. But I want you to save your money and, and don't mistrust everybody. Don't side eye everybody. If you want to be happy, you're going to be happy with who you are. If every time you look up, someone's asking for something, that's not happiness. That's them being greedy and taking advantage. And you just got to see where your happiness lies, okay? And it's going to lie in things that are working out for you. Looks like work's going to be moving forward. And this property matter, whatever was going on with property matters in the past, it's going to be coming at you in a different way. So those are the things that you you have to look forward to stability decision making dealing with how you feel when you don't get your way in situations okay it keeps talking about you being cranky but then it's going to lift with career things are going to be looking good for you in that time frame really nice really nice really nice really nice really nice it's really nice it's still a little it's still a little pashes pash i said pash it's a little pashes <laughs> Passions, you know what I mean? Kind of past, but then uh, mm, a little past, and then mm, it's not gonna work out, baby. Move on, move on. That steel rod so big, that steel rod is so big. You want to walk around it? I'm telling you, you're gonna walk around and get hit in the head. So, whatever's going on with property matters and so on and so on, there is offers on the table for you. You'll need to be patient. If, if there's anything that you need to look out for, there are offers. For more. Anything you need to look out offers for more. The things that you do not need to look out for is going to be losses. And this authority figure. This man, this person, I'm not going to even go into that. Okay. So you're going to be thinking about maybe giving them a chance. Hell, I just told you that still rod going to get slapped in the face again. And here we go getting slapped. It's okay though, because you need to be patient with yourself. There is no part time in with this situation. There is no part time and there is no oh maybe if it could ooh, maybe if I just see the good in it. Maybe if I just walk away and then just try to be that, 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 that. maybe if I maybe if we share something, maybe if we sneak around and do something together, maybe if we have a dinner or a date or I invite them over, the answer is hell to the no 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 is deader than any dog in the street. <laughs> coronavirus that's what's going on that dog is out there dead with the other and shout out to your mind shout out to your mind leave that situation alone it is as dead 
Well, we are uh, um, hoping that people that are ill, we are hoping that people that are not feeling good with the virus are going to have safe recovery. <laughs> okay, so here we go with um, celebrating a good time with someone. You shouldn't be that. I'm moving on. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not doing all that. Okay. So what you need to do is focus on your money. Focus on your money and leave love. I keep telling you. I've told you this since all year. I've told you the same thing. I didn't say, when I say leave love alone, I'm talking about that particular person that we have been talking about for a year. I keep telling you no to the no to the no to the no, 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 to the no to the no to the no, no, no. And it has continued to show no. No, no, no. 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 From Friday. No. Do not do it. So you've gotten to a point to where you're trying to make it work. Doing little things to make it work. Kind of moving over. Maybe if I move over, yeah, I give it a couple of days, I'll be fine. No. I told you, if you try to move this steel post on the other side, you're going to get slapped in the face. And in the month of April, going into May, do what you want to do. You're a grown woman, but it's going to slap you so hard. The thing about it is this person is dealing with others. I've told you that a lot of times. Whatever image they come back to you with, when they last dealt with you, is what you need to move on from. That's the ticket to move on. They know you now. They know you on your south side. You want them to know you on your south side for doing certain things when it is important. Not the BS. Not things they can get away from and then come back. You know, that type of thing. And that's the energy that you are leaving with them. That you can be walked over. You can be manipulated. But they're not looking at your patient and your kind. You're not looking at somebody that's uh, appreciating you for your value. At all. You need to let them go. Clearly it says this money is coming in for this property. No to marriage, no to commitment, no to try to make that thing work, and no to tr no to try to almost uh, have a certain mood swing to try to woo the relationship back in or or fool yourself. Go ahead and do all of that because when you get into end of May, going into June, it's new things anyway. You're about to move. You have this income coming in. You're about to catch new hours. Why would you need something like that to keep you from making decisions to move on new things? Come on. Come on. That's what's going on for you. So you're still in the pot with this. And everything else is moving around. And things are moving around slowly because you're still allowing the main part, the main part of your feelings, the main actions, the thing that you deal from, the thing that you talk with. You're giving it all to a situation that's dead. So you're going to feel like things are slow. You're going to have to find a way to put that to the side and push through. These things are just going to go ahead and come through. You're taking too long, mama. You're taking too long, so it's going to end uh, without you having anything to do with it. Anything you're going to try is going to end. Anything you try to do is going to take you back. It's going to take you back. It's going to take you back. And I don't know what to tell you. Learn your lessons. Move on with your life. New things are approaching you. I really enjoy working with you. I just wish that you would listen. And I wish that you would come out of your feelings and try to just learn that. Just learn to come out of your feelings and where to put the feelings. You have to come out of it and leave them right there. And when it's time to address it, you have two choices. Go by what you see or give it another chance to get hit in the head again. Somebody won't change. They're going to come to you with change. Okay? And I wouldn't wait on it. God bless.